morning everybody welcome to monday and welcome to another weekly vlog it is about nine o'clock i am up and at it today because there is a man coming here to do things which if you was watched watched last week's vlog then i spoke about it at the very end but yeah i'm up i have just made my breakfast i've got some weedy bakes and hot milk and a cup of tea and some orange juice I don't know about anybody else, but I need a cold drink in the morning. Like, I don't know what it is. And I've always been like that. Whether it be a glass of, like, really cold milk. Or orange juice or apple juice or something like that. I am actually going to get editing last week's vlog. Before this man arrives. I don't know what time he's going to be here. Or if I actually have to do anything. I just go with the flow. I'm looking slightly more presentable now. It is a quarter past one and I didn't mention what I was doing this morning but it sounds really like suspicious if I don't mention it but basically I was, I was thinking at a funeral but like that just sounds so morbid to actually like say I don't know. I don't know why I even feel the need to like justify it but I do. <laughs> so I was singing at a funeral this morning hence why I'm in black as well but focus there we are i'm just eating my lunch now i've just made some egg on toast and a cup of tea of course because what's new i have made a good dent in my editing for today for last week's vlog so hopefully you enjoyed that if you watched it and i'm just gonna eat this and then get straight back into it look what arrived oh my god I'm so excited so i'm gonna open it and charge it up and play about with it oh my god i'm so happy also i'm watching milan on our new tv why is it not focusing the picture quality of this tv is unreal but we need daddy to put we were going to have it on a tv stand but everything is very one level in this room so i feel like we need something up higher just to bring a bit of height into the room i don't know it just Everything feels very low. I went to the bath, I washed my hair, I put on another layer of tan and I'm feeling like a new person. But it is five past eleven. I'm actually getting a bit hungry. We had our dinner at what time? Way around seven. But I'm hungry so I'm gonna go make myself even just like tea and toast. I feel like tea and toast is so, I was supposed to say overrated, underrated great snack also please excuse i've just like kind of dried my hair i haven't obviously straightened it and i just stuck this hair by long to get it out of my way but i am going to take on bridgerton i don't know if that's how you say it but i really want to start watching it so i'm gonna start watching it tonight here we go here we go <laughs> let me make sure the address is on it oh my god it's my phone Good morning everyone, welcome to Tuesday. As you'll just have seen, my new phone has arrived. It is setting up estimated time about 21 minutes. Fantastic, but yeah, I'm just setting up my phone. I watched an episode of Bridgerton this morning and I've just started another one. So I'm on episode three. Now it says time remaining of about five minutes. I don't understand, but anyway. Also, a foot still arrived. Please excuse the mess, but what's new? If it's still arrived because we both, I say we, she and I, both sit we're feet up all the time and there was nothing to do that in, in this room. So that is from Donnell. There's a few other things arriving, but yeah, that is kind of all that's been happening today. Oh, I need to put my screen protector on my new phone as well. But I need to go for a shower and wash off some of this tan and then I'm going to get into sports leggings and a sweatshirt or something with a few messages to do and then I, do, I really really want to go on a walk. Not even want to, I actually need to go on a walk because I've been so lazy. As we're well aware if we watched last week's vlog. I decided that on the days where I have Nothing like planned or anything. Oh, I should have brought last night. Oh, well, that I'm gonna give myself basically something to do. 
and today I have a few messages to do and like the town over from us so I have to go to the bank I'm gonna go to B&M and then Mummy has a few messages for me to do as well home from the jobs that I had to do Andre is building a desk I might focus Andre is currently building a desk and that's what the noise is but I just thought that I would run through very quickly I'm not this is not very exciting at all but the stuff I got in B&M and I'm still out of fucking focus there we go I can't even set you up anywhere so I'm gonna have to turn you around that might work okay this is the most unflattering angle ever but I got these just for cleaning I got a, a room spray. This is Febreze Hermes Lenore Sparkling Bloom Scent. Mmm, that's nice. Then I got some duck for my toilet. I got some disposable face masks. Essentials. I had to get a big thing of dry shampoo. This was only three pound. This is huge. How many mil is it? 400 mil. And then the last thing I got is an oil burner for in here. And I'm just realizing I got white and in here is cream. Fuck it, I'll be okay. Just because the candle that I have in here at the minute is like run out. Or very, very close to run out. So I just thought I would get an oil burner because I have lots of the melts that she got me for Christmas. So I thought I would just use those instead of getting a new candle. And that is my extremely exciting B and M haul. Also this mug, if you have just seen it in the background, Shane's brother and his fiance got me it for Christmas. Fiance, yeah. So I said are they married yet? No. They're actually due to get married a week after I'm due. One week. One single week. She is best man. If I go 10 days over, I will be 41 weeks pregnant. Not through when. 40 weeks? I don't know. Whatever the fuck I'll be. No, I'll be, for, I'll be 41 weeks pregnant. Not through when. Oh my god. <laughs> it is a Tuesday, which means I go to Shane's on a Tuesday, so I've wrapped up kind of warm. Ish because I think we might be going for a short walk. Possibly, maybe not. And uh, we got the fee money, mm -hmm. and we're happy. Uh, we're happy for that, but we still. Uh, Yo. Still and uh, we're gonna get Yo, up, to up United. There was a, a Point United. What do you say? Decisions, particularly yeah, in the first yeah, half. Yeah. How difficult. United, United, United. <laughs> when... Hello, everyone. Welcome to Wednesday. It is quarter past twelve. I was up very early. This, very early. Very very early for me. I was up like before eight o'clock. It's really not that early, is it? No, it's not. But for me, it is. I was doing a funeral this morning, so my way home, I stopped at Pabby's in Dunloy and got some buns and stuff. So I'm now sitting down to have one with a cup of tea. Mummy was like, you need your lunch first. And I was like, no, I don't. Also, look at my hair, it was raining. But this is like a donut, apparently, with chocolate and cream, something. And this is a Biscoff Rice Krispie Square. But I wanted, <laughs> I wanted a custard slice. I asked her if they had any, and she was like, no, you're the second person who asked that. I didn't even know what they are. And I was like, what? Custard slices are the best things to get out of a bakery and she works in a bakery and had never heard of it. I honestly was like, you what? But mummy had asked me, she had texted me during the funeral and asked me to go or stop in Dunloy on the way home and get stuff and ever since she said it I was like, all I was thinking about was this custard slice that I was going to get and I didn't have any. So it's been a traumatic morning, very traumatic. <laughs> but I'm gonna continue watching Bridgerton and I am in episode six. 
So I have like this and two more left. And then that's me finished with it already. I've done nothing today. Apart from, <coughs> oh, someone just caught my throat. Apart from, do that funeral. And I just finished Bridgerton, 10 out of 10. Kinda, you know what actually, it's better to say I'm kinda raging it took me so long, but I'm not because I'm watching it now when everybody else has watched it and hype is like over. So I was kinda watching it like not at the same time as everybody, so not thinking probably the same things as everybody else because then everybody else was putting up stuff about it. I wasn't paying attention because I wasn't watching it, if that makes any sense. But now I'm just gonna watch everything you need for a newborn baby. I'm just gonna start probably looking into stuff. We actually have made our first purchases for the baby. Oh my god, I'm getting a headache right here. That hurt. Uh, yeah, we made our first two purchases. She had actually sent me it and said that there was a boy in his sight that said this thing was really good. I'm out of focus. So yeah, he was like, have you seen this? This boy on my site says this is really good. And I was like, yes, I have that saved. That is what I wanted anyway. So it was down, it was like on sale. And then something that went along with it was also on sale. So I bought the two of them. And I'm actually not going to show, it's meant to be arriving on Saturday or they're meant to be arriving on Saturday. But I think I'm gonna wait and do like an entire baby haul whenever I've bought like enough things to make a haul. I don't want to show like wee snippets every now and again. I want to actually do like a proper baby haul so but yeah so I won't be showing things I'm buying as I go along but if anybody has any recommendations of videos like this this is Home with Shan. I am loving her at the minute. I actually only found her whenever I got pregnant, like I found her at about six weeks I would say and I've just been watching all her videos since and what do you call that girl? Lucy Jessica Carter, I actually think she's El Darby's sister. I don't actually watch El Darby, like I didn't even know who she was but I had seen her sister before and then she had this video of it was something about her sister but blah, blah blah. Anyway, everybody's obsessed El Darby, it's her sister. I don't know, I've tried to watch some of her videos. Not my style, I don't know. I don't know, just not my my YouTube vibe. But yeah, I've been enjoying those two and also, oh my God, what was the girl? Oh, uh, Brittany, uh, what was her name? Ba Balin, Balin or something. Only found her like last week and obsessed already. Watched all her videos and kind of now have nothing to watch of hers anymore. So yeah, I'm gonna watch this video. Um, I'm gonna be making dinner tonight, but we're just having tortilla pizzas, which is like, everybody can just make their own anyway. So I just went and got like the stuff for it, but I'm not hungry. It is 25 past six and I'm just not hungry. Oh, also I had a nap for like an hour because I was so tired. I felt like first trimester-y tired. That's how tired I felt. If you know, you know. Dinner is served. The chicken actually like looks as if it's not cooked, but it's already cooked chicken. <laughs> so it's fine. And these are like garlic and sweet potato wedges things. I also doubled up the base. So there's like two wraps, but I didn't put the sauce all the way out to the side, which is a bit, was a bit silly of me, but so it kind of like turned up at the edges while it was cooking. Morning everybody, welcome to Thursday. It's half 11. I am just about to start my Pilates. I'm just staying in my pajamas because I can pretty much. So I'm just gonna do it now because I meant to do it on Tuesday evening. I meant to do it yesterday and I didn't do it. So I thought I'm getting up today and I'm doing it so I just had my breakfast. I have been watching, I'm really out of breath. <laughs> I've been watching this morning so I'm just gonna set up my laptop. I'm obviously already on my exercise ball. 
I keep on calling a medicine ball and it's definitely not. I just think I need to pump this up a wee bit more. It feels a wee bit flat, but it can wait till after. I need to sit on this more. My left arm is getting sore, so I'm gonna stop vlogging. <laughs> that is my platies done. It was much more challenging today, I thought, than or compared to last week. But I've just made my lunch. It is about half one. I'm having an omelette with loads of paranese on it, of course. I've already drank two of these today, I think. So I'm doing very well on my water. What is that, 750 ml? I am such a water drinker. It's like actually a wee bit weird. People, when people tell me that they struggle, or when I hear people talking about struggling with drinking water, I'm like, what? Hi. I put some makeup on. I did my hair, even though it's been getting greasy really quickly. And I don't know if that's a pregnancy thing, if I need to change my shampoo or whatever. So if that's a thing, let me know. Three new breakouts. I haven't had breakouts in a while. Three of them at the one time. But I got dressed, if this counts. I've just put on The Queen's Gambit to start watching it. And I'm 13 minutes in and I don't focus again. Oh my God. Um, yeah, I'm 13 minutes in and I'm just not sure. Um, I don't know. Maybe I just like can't concentrate on it, but it's just a bit weird. I don't know. I obviously am gonna give it a good go. I'm not just gonna switch off after 13 minutes. <laughs> but Shane is on his way over. He's just coming straight over after work. We're gonna have dinner and then he is going to either run the same 5k that he did the other night in the town and I'm gonna go for a walk just like for around the same time. I'm obviously not gonna walk the 5k because I'll be going a hell of a lot slower than he'll be running and I'm obviously not gonna run it because this girl doesn't run and she definitely doesn't run in pregnancy. It is much later now. Oh. Much later, and Mummy and I met Rebecca there for a walk. Shane did his run and then went home. But I am just sitting, charging my Fitbit actually, for myself a glass of juice. I'm gonna have a wee packet of crisps and chill, and then go to the bath. My hips started to get a wee bit sore just when we were walking, but nothing like major. So I need to like loosen them out. I need to go for more walks. That's just so hard finding the, mo the motivation to actually go for the walks. Hello everybody, welcome to Friday. It is almost two o'clock and I actually had another funeral this morning. So, oh, such horrible work, but I suppose it's just the way it is. But yeah, it's nearly two o'clock. I am really tired. I don't feel like I slept that good last night. I had to sleep, I didn't have to, but I slept with the window open because I've been feeling really, really congested all week when I've woken up. Uh, so I slept with the window open, just have some fresh air. And then I woke up and my room was so cold. And mummy brought me in a cup of tea and was like, Hannah, this room is absolutely Baltic. But yeah, I just had my lunch and I am on episode two of The Queen's Gambit and I don't know how many times I've paused it already. And I'm only 10 minutes in. I don't know, just not feeling it. Let me know if you felt this way about it as well. Like, I really want to see the whole thing out, but at the same time, I really cannot be bothered. Just made myself a cup of tea, and then I'm gonna have a yogurt as well. And something exciting arrived, as well as the first baby things arrived. <laughs> like I said, I'm not gonna show you, but the, they arrived, and I'm, oh my god. I remember my dad and I were both like, oh. and I was like, lads, I'm due in 17 weeks. Like, it's okay to buy things now. They're just so worried, as parents are. But yeah, I'm gonna show you what arrived for in here. So this mat arrived. Now, it obviously needs hoovered. And then it needs like flattened out a bit still. Obviously it was rolled up, so yeah. We finally got the mat. Also a TV unit came, but we don't think we're gonna use it anymore. Think we're go we think we're going to put the TV up on a bracket 
instead because everything like I was saying I think in this vlog everything is very one level and we need something a wee bit higher so I think we're gonna put it up on the wall I promise at some point oh Andrew I promise at some point in this vlog I'm not just gonna be sitting in this spot I don't know when that'll be but I promise not to just be sitting in this spot but I had an hour and a half nap earlier I'm so tired recently but now I'm just gonna sit and watch some nature videos I was gonna watch The Queen's Gambit I have like 13 minutes left of an episode but I really just I'm not, I'm not feeling it at all we had dinner, daddy made dinner tonight he made buttered chicken he also made very 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 crunchy naan bread and mummy broke a tooth <laughs> I don't even know how you make naan bread crunchy, but he managed. So I'm gonna drink some water. I never have glasses of water, I always have a bottle. And eat some poppets, which are the best. Morning everyone, welcome to Saturday. I have just had my breakfast, I'm sitting watching some friends. This is the episode where Ross cheats on Rachel. And I've just texted Shane to say that's what I was watching, and he said they were on a break. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Let me know if you agree. But mommy and I are gonna go into town to get some groceries and then go for a walk. Mummy and I are home. We did what I said we were gonna do and went and got the groceries and then went for a walk and it was nice just to get some fresh air. I felt my hip again already, so it's not ideal. But I'm actually filming a video today. I'm gonna do my makeup and answer some pregnancy questions. I really need to wash my hair so that's why it's like slicked back and I'm literally just wearing like a black t-shirt. But I'm gonna film out here. It's more chilled I think so I'm gonna set up and then I'm gonna eat my lunch and then I'm gonna get filming. Video filmed. My eyelash glue is actually still not right and I've just been ages like taking pictures and everything but Still not right, but I am now back into my dressing gown because what else would you expect? I'd be disappointed if you thought that it would be different than this. It's not. But I'm actually just going to start editing that video right now. I would really like to get it up this evening or tomorrow morning. We'll just see how we get on. Steak for dinner tonight. Oh my god, I'm so excited for this. Yeah, Yummy! Morning everyone, welcome to Sunday. I have just finished editing the video that I wanted to edit yesterday, but she arrived and that didn't happen. So I tried to finish editing it last night, but I just got so tired. I wasn't in bed then until about half two or something, which was so silly. So I had a big lay in this morning. It is quarter past 12, so it's actually not the morning I lied. But that is just saving now. And I'm gonna go for a shower because I really, really need to wash this hair. It is in bad, bad nick. I'm all clean and I'm about to tint my eyebrows. So you'll see, wow, oh, yeah, you'll be able to see my eyebrows are like non-existent at the minute. And I'm also losing a lot of hair in like the tail of my right eyebrow, which I have no idea why. And it's pretty frustrating. So I got the Allure Dye Brow, permanent tip for brows in black. I've used this before. I got it in black because the black is like a cooler tone whereas the dark brown is quite a warm brown and that's not what I want. So we just get the black and then basically leave it on for less time so it's not black but it's a nicer colour so what do I do it again? Pleasure your eyebrow, pair one eye at a time, carefully spread a barrier cream. I don't have a barrier cream. I don't think I've ever used like Vaseline or anything to go around it. Maybe I should. No, fuck it. Okay, one centimeter of colored cream. Three drops of the activating solution. And then it comes with like a wee spilly, so I'm just gonna use other end of the spilly and mix it together. So my mayor Beck and I are actually going to 
Asda. I need to get a move on because I obviously need to dry my hair. And then I just get a cotton bud and put it on that way into my eyebrow. Oh my god, my eyebrows are so light. I'm just going to take another cotton bud and clean it up a bit. Okay, I'm actually going to get another cotton bud. Just another clean one and kind of wipe off the front of the brows a bit. Oh my god, <laughs> look. Mental. I'm gonna moisturize my body. That looks a complete mess, but we'll come back to it. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna wet. It. Well, I have wet a cotton pad. Take it and wipe, wipe it off. I mean, you should definitely use a barrier cream <laughs> to not get it on your skin. Well, now at least you can see that I have eyebrows. I put on a bit of makeup and they still look kind of crazy. Yeah, they look kind of crazy, but oh well. So whenever Mummy and I came home from getting the groceries, we actually went to Tesco's because there's Tesco's closer to us than there is an Asda. It was time for the United match, so we all just sat in here watching the United match because the new TV in here, the picture quality is really, really good. So we sat and watched the United match and Andre has like just left. He's been in this room for over seven hours today. So I haven't really been able to vlog, but I managed to get my video up, my pregnancy Q&A and get ready with me. So hopefully you watched that. But now I'm just gonna get caught up on some YouTube videos. I've made myself toast and tea. I don't know why I said it like that, tea and toast. And yeah, I'm just gonna watch a few YouTube videos. Everybody basically it uploads on a Sunday, so great Sunday night view. And I missed Dancing on Ice because we were also watching Ireland's Fittest Family then, which was really good tonight. There's actually a family in it from like 15 minutes away from me and they were absolutely unbelievable. Like they were incredible. So we were watching that tonight. So that is why I didn't get to watch Dance on Ice. So I might stick it on after I've caught up on all my YouTube videos. I really could have picked a time where I looked better to end this week's vlog, but whatever, I've just done my skincare. I've picked up my skin a bit, which you can definitely see. And I've also added some castor oil to my eyebrows and my eyelashes just to help them grow. Obviously I spoke about this eyebrow, but also my eyelashes have been falling out quite a bit. Oh baby, <laughs> just got a real big wriggle there. 
but yeah that is the end of this week's vlog so i hope you enjoyed it if you did please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and hopefully i'll see you in my next one bye